everyone welcome back today i want to do a video discussing the similarities and differences between till the end of the moon particularly tan tai jin and love of nirvana and wei jiao so let's get right into it so for similarities between these two shows first of all you have the male lead who is out for revenge who has been bitterly betrayed by people around him and who is righteously doing um wrong by the people that have wronged them so like it kind of makes sense you get their message but then you also have the female lead who is not completely on board with everything the male lead is doing although the differences between that as well is that the female lead in love and nirvana is a bit more supportive of the male lead than the female lead in till the end of the moon which is primarily because the male lead until the end of the moon is known as the devil god and even though wei jiao has actually given a very similar moniker um he's not perceived nearly as badly as Tan Tai Jin, which is, I guess, another difference. But I like to think that um, the female lead in Love and Nirvana would actually have been way kinder to Tan Tai Jin than Susi would have been, even if they were placed in like a very similar situation. But I am also trying to think about it in the context of Love and Nirvana and how the female lead has a master. So think about the fact that if like Tan Tai Jin hurt her, her master, like how would she have coped with that but i feel like with love and nirvana she's very forgiving and is willing to like kind of like lay down everything and kind of relax compared to susu until the end of the moon like susu is very like abrasive and very upfront and although i do think that she shares similarities with um Dianchi and um Love of Nirvana, I think Jianchi is more likely to be like, to like let go after a while, more than Susu. And I do believe there'd be less toxicity between Tang Tai Jin and um, Jianchi, even with like a similar context. But what I really want to talk about is the fact that like, I am expecting Wei Zhao to die at the end of Love of Nirvana. I've been expecting this since episode one, because in episode one, um, he's like jailing this prisoner and the prisoner's like you won't have a good end you're gonna die from then on i knew that this story was gonna have a sad ending like i'm not expecting even like a bittersweet ending i'm expecting it to be really sad and but with like children of the moon like i it was really sad throughout the entire thing and then the ending was really like i was shocked because everybody tells me the book does not end like the, the like the show and i don't think the show had to go for the sad ending like i don't think it was necessary after everything that had transpired until the end of the moon to end it sadly it, it honestly felt like so unnecessary like i was like do you have to end it like this and i think i felt for some reason i feel more bad for tan tai jin even though i do think him and wage out on, on like a similar situation and i perceive similarly Similarly, within their context, I feel, I felt and feel way more bad for Tan Tai Jin than I did for Wei Zhao. And maybe it's because I've always expected Wei Zhao to die and I, I, I always hoped and hope for the best for Tan Tai Jin. And that's where like the difference lies, even though the situations are so similar. It's like what is expected versus what is not expected and the shock that comes with it is actually like shaping my response more so than being like these two are in similar contexts and so i'm going to feel the same about them because they're like practically the same people it's not like that i hope everything i just said made sense um let me know what you think about this in the comments below if you are currently watching love of nirvana if you've watched till the end of the moon let me know what you think about this and how you kind of feel about these characters if you see the same similarities or differences that i do or if you have a different set of similarities and differences please let me know and i hope you have a good day thanks so much for listening if you like my channel please subscribe if you like this video please hit the like button below thanks so much again bye